This is a delta T antenna. How do you make a delta T antenna? It's easy. You wind a loop, diamond shape, on x-axis. You wind another loop at 90 degrees to it, diamond shape, on the y-axis. And you wind a third loop, diamond shape, around the perimeter of this thing. What does this thing look like? Here up is one pyramid. Here down is another pyramid. This is two pyramids, base to base, one pointing up, one pointing down. You build up a thought form in here with the XY loops using the correlated white noise that will grab the thought form and rotate it. It will spin, it will spin it into a cylinder, and as that cylinder is rotating, it has to bend time to get the rotation. It means now you're generating liquids of time coming off this rotating cylinder, and this is a time vortex, as talked of in quantum electrodynamics. So as this thing spins, the imaginary cylinder in here spins, or it's called a spinner in physics, so that's the time wave. Now let's have our demonstration, the fun part. is red with delta variant spread but of course deaths and hospitalizations uh and almost everywhere is down way down right we're at a very low baseline now we are going to have a slight rise with the delta variant but the delta variant really is not responsive at all or protected at all by the vaccines so 42 percent of 90,000 proven delta cases in the uk have been vaccinated and in the Israel, they estimate right now from the Israel Health Authorities that the vaccine efficacy rate is only about 60 to 70 percent. So we expect Delta cases in fully vaccinated individuals. It'll be a mild rise. It's easily treatable in high risk patients. There's no reason right now, no clinical reason yeah. to go get vaccinated. is red with delta variant spread Bye. <laughs> 